Well, he started off as favorite, but had to show the heart of a champion in order to add the diamond stakes to another impressive win in the President's Cup earlier. Yes, General JN showed his pedigree in holding of challengers to his left and right before getting to the line first in the co-feature on Republic Day out at Santa Rosa Park. Coming out of the far turn now, and it's that yellow cap of Master of War. Master of War, the leader. On the inside there is Whisper Light circling horses as General JN, together with this one's for run. They all turn as a pair into the home stretch they come, and it's Master of War with the lead. General JN is running on. Then comes this one's for run on furthest out. Whisper Light is there. A wild finish in the Diamond Stakes inside the final 200 meters. Master of War and General JN. General JN takes over the running. Master of War, game effort, and this one's for run. General JN wins it. Master of War, big effort for second. This one's for on third. Nuclear power fourth. Well, another majestic ride by Rico Hernandez to ensure victory as General JN makes it 10 wins in 12 starts for a most impressive record indeed, causing owner Jerry Naris to wonder aloud about the possibilities of this horse. Well, I will confess there were some anxious moments, but I had every faith and confidence that he's up to the task. As I told you here after the President's Cup, that I think he's a great Caribbean find. I would like to see him race in the Diamond Mile, and I would like to see him race in the Confederation Cup in Miami. I think this horse really is a fantastic find, and I would just like to see what his potential is.